Good morning guys and welcome to today's video. Sometimes I'm like trying to get stuff done while I video. But anyway, good morning. Welcome to today. Today's video is all about the biggest egg on earth. Uh, today's video is all about pushing limits, setting goals, and mastering something that we've never done before. What are we doing today, Gabby? Swimming with horses! Yeah, we are gonna only take two because they, we need to be able to manage our horses well in the water and... Just joking, that is not how we roll. We are taking extra people so that we can take all of our horses and have the best experience. You said we were bringing all. Sophie, do you think you're gonna swim with your horse? Oh, I'm not swimming, I'm just going in. On the Sam, Sam, do you think Sophie's gonna swim? I'm gonna swim with Finn. Are you really? Yeah. Gabby, do you think this is going to be the year that you actually swim yes. with Storm? Yes. There's no way in heck that this girl is going to get on a horse and swim. I just can't do it, you guys. But I'm going to take my girl out there in the water and let her have fun. We will see what happens. But that's my goal right now. No. I just want to take him out there and let him see the water. And then you're going to decide? Yeah. Yeah, me too. Crack that giant egg, Sylvie. Give me a double. Double. Yay. Yay. All right, we are getting ready to go. Are you nervous? No. No? Getting ready. So some of you guys are wondering, how the heck do we take Lolo places with us? We take her, uh, if it's like super close and super local, then we fit Finn and Willow into this tiny spot. They're both small. Just wait, let me see if I can get a good view. So it's... This space here is as is bigger than this space back here. So this is three quarters of our trailer, and this is like a less big space, right? Does that make sense? Does it make sense? Yeah. That's like a stall. Yeah. This this is like uh, more like a stall. So uh, it also has two cross ties. Uh, one is able to hook up on this side and one is able to hook up on this side and it fits them both and you know what Finn is like and he manages really well with Willow in here and because we have the camera in the in our truck we're able to actually watch them together and he seems to prefer having her there with him so it goes all the way back to here and we have this thing here that holds our saddles and stuff this little wall here, it holds all of our stuff. It actually closes and so it separates our trailer into two different sections. It's actually really cool. Even though our trailer is just this homely gray color and not all pretty and white and special looking, like I like it to look a little bit more fancy, but this trailer is my heart trailer. I love it. I can carry four horses, our four horses on it, as long as it's just for a short period of time and we don't do it very often. And I love it. I literally love this trailer. I don't think you can take a saddle pad. I'm not riding bareback. What about if we took Stella's saddle pad? Like the western saddle is like plastic. You can ride it in the water. Yeah, but that doesn't fit Finn. Do you want to ride Finn in the water or maybe you would ride Stella to swim? Stella. Alright, so we'll take Finn, let him experience the water, but then you'll ride Stella in the water? Yeah, I can ride Stella. And we'll take the western saddle pad. Okay. Let's check Hello. with the boss. Let's check with the boss. Look at your hair. It's I not brushed. It. There's no way. It's brushed. Sophie and I have a plan. If I can get you in the focus here. All right, so Sophie doesn't want to ride Finn out deep in the water. She's going to stop. She's going to take she's going to take care of him in the water. But she wants to ride Stella with a saddle. So can we take the Western saddle? Why? It's plastic. It won't get wrecked. The saddle pad? Yeah, I know. I was wondering about the saddle pad. What do you think about the saddle pad? I'm just going to get too wet. Yeah, but I can dry well, it. I'm, not I'm being uncomfy on her. I'm not swimming, swimming. I'm just going, walking in the water. Okay. I'm not going. As long as well, you can... the saddle pad doesn't go wet. All right, well, you can well, do that on... Well, get a little bit wet. You can do that on Finn. Yeah, but his saddle is going to get so ruined. 
No, if him. you're just gonna walk out on him. No, get a little deeper. That All right, something. let me con let me contact the next boss, and I'll see what happens then. The thing that's so misleading about this little tiny hay bag is that I'm pretty sure she eats more than this. She oh, does. that's a good idea, Soph. You're you've got it going on. Hey, handsome, and handsome too. Are you guys excited? Dusty. That was like, take me too. Don't worry, or I'll come in. Yeah, they like. I think they're gonna have fun. So all of our horses have had experience with water, right? Oh uh, yeah. Because we took them to a trail, and there was water, and we played in it. They all got to walk in it. Yeah, that's hay. Did they have lunch? No. They're gonna have lunch on the trailer. Normal. You won't eat anything. You better give him some hay right now then. Give him some hay. He has to have a good... Is that a bite on his side? No. That's him itching himself. Hours from dawn as I'm driving at night Waiting to get somewhere What can go wrong when we say it out right? I really wish you were here People seem to know just where they're heading While you and I just feel like we're pretending I can't do it on my own When I'm this far away from home Won't you tell me something good Lola wanted me to put on her hump. Yeah, the horse knows. She knows when it's time. Oh, his tail. Willow went up to Sam and said, put my halter on. Okay, so um, Gab's going to lead me now because... My, my I feeling... Really, I put Willow in front of myself. Well, help your my feeling is the smaller the horse, the bigger the but, brain. Uh, Willow's already freaking out thinking that we're going to leave her behind. And that breaks my heart. And that's why we take her everywhere. And that is why we are going to be getting her another friend. Ready or not, wanting to or not, we are. And I'm going to tell you guys that story very soon. Won't you tell me something good? As I think of you and I, there's too much going to pass us by if we don't talk like we should. Won't you tell me something good? Weekend is gone and we're lying in bed. Whenever we do stuff like this, I always feel nervous. I feel so much nerves. And then I always pray to God to take care of us. And I know that I never want to have horses and not do fun things with them. So we just got to trust, have faith, and have faith that if anything happens, God will get us through it. Through it. And I would much rather do things and have something happen than never do anything because of fear. I turned on my phone and this popped up and it said, step out and say, this may look impossible in the natural, but I know with God, all things are possible. Hey, so the worst thing has happened. Essentially, we're a kilometer from the water. We started to have technical difficulties on the trailer. Thank the Lord, Sam understands that stuff. He has to, it's his trailer. The axle on our trailer broke. The axle, literally, we cannot walk. We cannot drive our horses another step. Another step, we're, we're trapped on the side of the road with four horses. I don't know how we're gonna fix this. I messaged Fiona, I said, we're in an emergency. And nothing, not a nothing. Call her, I thought you were calling. Oh, there she messaged me back now. Yeah, so we're gonna, we're gonna ride there, you guys. Uh, so weird, but luckily it happened now and not on our trip. And what about tomorrow then? Yeah, so we will not be having lessons out tomorrow. We might not even get home. All right, let's figure this out. Oh, there's Fancy Finn. Of course he's sweating. He's like, what is happening here? All right, so we got a plan, you guys. We're not idiots. Well, maybe we are. I don't know. All right, and there you go. You're okay. It's okay. We should spray them, maybe. Hi, Willow. We're going for a trail. All right. Sam's going to take the trailer and see if he can get it fixed. We're going to ride to swim. All right. I'm trying to get it fixed. I could put stuff in my backpack, too. Yeah, let's fill your backpack. Can you put the hay bags in your truck? When you... 
from back so they can have hay. Have to leave the trailer or not? Okay. Let's see if they can do anything. All right. Tell them it's emergency. Like we're we're stranded. We're stranded with horses. I can't carry like anything else in here. Maybe a small thing. You don't need, leave the bumper. Oh, we might need to bring the bumpers in case somebody has yeah, to come yeah. pick us up. I have to, I'll take everything then. Okay. I have a bumper. Storm, take it easy, dude. Yes, it's exciting. Okay. This is our first catastrophe, really. I mean, besides me falling and breaking a lot of bones. It is working out. Oh. Oh. Don't not drag my husband. Good girl. Do not drag my horse, husband. Good girl. You're okay. Let's get you bridled up, honey. So look, you guys. I tacked up on the side of the road. I'm freaking out a little, but we have my sister here, so I'm trying not to. Don't waste it. It's like, is there anything coming? We're good, Stella. All right, you guys. We got it going on. We got Miss Gabby up there with no saddle. You guys have been asking Gabby to ride bareback for a while. Well, it happened today. Another car, this road's busy. So we got Sarah up here and Stella. I said, do you want to ride Stella? She's like, no. <laughs> I'm like, it'll be the most fun thing you, it'll be the most fun thing you've done all year. Willow behind here. I'm ponying Willow and I got Sophie. Chicken Sophie. We got Sarah who has never really even ridden before on horseback and we got Chicken Sophie. Chicken Sophie and Chicken Finn. Finn does, he wants to go. He's like, I wanna go with my friends. We also have my sister up there stopping every few feet to take pictures of us. <laughs> take pictures of Sarah, cause that's what you do. That's what mothers do, Gabby says. Catching a fly. So, <laughs> Gabby's on bareback. Stella is in the front now where she likes to be. And the reason is because Storm's afraid of mailboxes, you guys. like. Storm is the best horse, except for he's afraid of mailboxes. <laughs> Behind us, I hear this like skitter, the skittery like, like something happened on the gravel. And then all of a sudden I hear Gabby. It's a mailbox storm. She's bareback. What's the matter, Self? I got food and water in Jackie's car. Oh, thank God. We're almost there. We're almost there. There is a scary trailer, boat trailer over there. Finn is checking out. Like, oh, it's in here. Storm's checking out the water. Like, oh. <laughs> Getting away. Storm. Storm. Watch, the, watch as I fall into the water. I forgot to bring the other battery. Watch as I fall into the water because my horse. Do not fall into the water. Uh, we're just so hot from walking here, this whole kilometer down the road that we all want to go in the water. Like even Stella, she's like, take me there. Okay, Stella, let's hold on here. It's not all gravel this time. Do you want Stella to go first? Cause she wants to. Do not jump in. <laughs> Stop in. <laughs> Sophie, be careful. He's decided it's a fire breathing dragon. Okay. They both have. And even Stella is on the on the Why don't you get down and we'll do what we did last year. Nice oh, and no getting back. <laughs> All right. Do you want me to take Stella? You you bring it. Wait another night One more night One more night I could fight it through Till the darkness turns to light One more night One more night Say it's gonna be okay Cause this winter is so long Feels like it's haunting me Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.